Hello, darlings. I am your host, John Victor, and welcome to Why You So Obsessed, JV. Today's episode goes out to all my fashion girls out there. We are going to be talking about the announcement, the Instagram announcement that kind of shook the fashion world yesterday. Luxury Law, Law Roach, announced on his Instagram that he is retired. He wrote a whole spiel about it, talking that he has had enough, that he's not doing this anymore, and that he's out. Actually, let's let's read the post because there's quite a bit to break down. So bear with me. Let me pull it up. Okay. So just big letters, just like a stamp, retired. He says, my cup is empty. Thank you to everyone who've supported me and my career over the years. Every person that trusted me with their image, I'm so grateful for you all. If this business was just about the clothes, I would do it for the rest of my life. But unfortunately, it's not. The politics, the lies, and the false narratives finally got me. You win. I'm out. Three hearts. I mean, a lot to break down there. Um, so a lot of people are finding a correlation with this post and the somewhat recent timing of the viral video of Law and Zendaya, um, his muse, at the Louis Vuitton fashion show. Um, the video shows... Basically, they're, you know, it's Emma Stone and Zendaya in the front row, and it almost looks like, you know, like Law was expecting a seat also in the front next to Zendaya, um, and he is not seated in the front. Uh, he goes to a seat in the back. It looks like there's an exchange between, you know, client and stylist. It's kind of open to interpretation what happened. And it's not to say that any of this is related, but a lot of people are saying that that could be, you know, a uh, a possible factor. I mean, you know, he also, Legendary was canceled earlier in this year. Who knows what's going on behind the scenes? Sometimes things bottle up, bottle up and it's a final straw situation. Now, I'm not saying that the Louis Vuitton fashion show and the seating arrangement was the final straw, but... I don't know. Who knows? A lot of people, IG sleuths are, you know, um, trying to, they're piecing that together, saying that could be a possible thing that went on. But who knows? We don't know what's going on behind the scenes. Um, I, I think being a gay man in fashion, even though they're responsible for so many looks and, and fashion trends and moments throughout history, are not given the proper credit that they deserve. That's just the facts of the matter. Um, you know, they don't get the same respect that their white and female counterparts, gay or straight, seem to receive. And that's not right. I mean, La Roach is one of, if not the biggest stylists in Hollywood. I mean, he dresses or has dressed Anya Taylor Joy, Anne Hathaway, Celine Dion, Kiki Palmer, but his collaboration with Zendaya is really that's the magic that we've that we have expected you know what i mean that is the they are an unstoppable team zendaya is a fashion icon because of la roach that's what it is um do i think that law is going to retire permanently i don't know i'm gonna say no not because I, not just because I want him to keep working because I, I, I like Law a lot. I think he's a character and obviously an amazing stylist. But I think some, like, I mean, Nicki Minaj has said before, oh, I'm retiring. I'm starting a family. I'm not doing this anymore. She's back making music. I think sometimes people get fed up just like we regular humans get burnout out and say, I'm done. I'm not doing this anymore. You know, celebrities, stylists, celebrity stylists are entitled to that. I but I think even if Law does decide not to do fashion anymore, Law is too much of a personality and too much of a character to not have on TV screens. He has a multitude of talents beyond fashion that he could continue to explore. I mean, he made legendary. I mean, of course the contestants, but I'm saying for the judging panel like without Law on the judging panel, the show would have been would not have been what it was. So Do I think that he's going to retire? No, I don't. I hope he doesn't. If he does, that's his decision. But I don't think this is the end. I think probably some shit has gone on behind the scenes. And it's a lot of work, what he does. 
and there's a lot of politics and trauma behind it. I think he'll be back. And Law, we hope you come back and take a break. Do what you need to do, but we will miss you if you decide to retire. Um, so please come back. You're too good. That's my two cents. I mean, what do we all think? Do you think that there's something else that's going on? Do we think that it's more than just a Louis Vuitton fashion show and legendary? And I mean, what do we think that this means for the future of a fashion? And Zendaya, I mean, I know she has that Louis Vuitton contract now. So I, I, look, I don't know. It all seems very up in the air. It's, it was legitimately a major fashion blow. Anyway, Pat, major fashion blow. Comment below and let me know what you all think. And I will be back soon with a new episode. All right. Love you, dolls. Bye-bye.